to Wembley. Fans started lining up early today outside Wembley Stadium for the third of seven sold-out concerts on Michael Jackson's Bad World Tour. He's brilliant. He's brilliant. He's totally wicked. There were also fans waiting outside Mr Jackson's hotel, hoping to catch a glimpse of the reclusive superstar heading for the stadium. When the stadium doors finally opened, it was impossible not to be overwhelmed watching the fans storm onto the field to get the coveted spot at the very front. We can hear the 72,000 fans anxiously screaming in anticipation, not realising the show has been delayed while Mr Jackson meets with Prince Charles and Diana, Princess of Wales, to present them with a donation to the Prince's Trust. People here have waited so long for the show that the anticipation level just creates mass hysteria. Finally, the show is about to start. Fans continue to press to the very front. Some already passing out and are being pulled from the crowd. Who'd have thought? Wembley Stadium, the home of Live Aid, the home of Nelson Mandela, and now the home of the king of it all.